So today is a results day. I feel sick. I feel worse than I did last year. This is my second time picking up A level results because last year it did not go very well. Literally remember the feeling. Uh, unfortunately all too well. <laughs> Literally I opened my results and I saw what I got. I was I don't think I've ever felt more disappointed in my life. So that's why this year there's even more pressure. Cause I just can't I, I can't fail again. Like I can't let myself fail again. So yeah, that's probably why I feel like not good. Um but yeah. After three years, hopefully I make it. I restart by myself, I didn't go back to sixth form. Instead, I restart with this academy. I did homeschooling with them and I did my exams with them. And I actually really tried this time and I actually used the resources around me and they were actually really helpful. So maybe I'll do well this time. I don't know, but we'll find out. So I'm here now, um, I've walked around this thing three times because I literally don't want to go in. I'm dreading it, yeah, wish me luck though. I'm going in. <sighs> Hello. So you're here for your results? Yep. Okay. What did you apply for? Politics and sociology. And where was the first said, choice? Uh, well, I applied for politics and sociology everywhere. Okay. And then uh, my first choice was Warwick and then Aston because it's the next lowest okay. offer. So right now your grades meet the criteria? Yep. Okay, so it's Warwick you're going to? Yeah. Congratulations. Thanks. So, I've got my results. I got into the uni I, want, I wanted. It's a bit anticlimactic now, and now it's like, now what do I do? I'm not waiting for results anymore. I'm happy though. After three years, I did it. It took a lot. But yeah, I don't really know what to do. I feel like it's just, it's too fresh still. Maybe I'll go home and like, cry some more. And then, yeah, that's it I guess. I got my results, I got in. I'm happy. Um yeah, there's a lot of emotions. <laughs>